Is it possible that there are no coincidences? And I sincerely hope there are no chemtrail deniers on my channel, because this is ridiculous. Wilmington, North Carolina. April 13th, it's uh, about 9.30 in the morning. This is insane. This is insane. Back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. They're killing us. They're spraying us like roaches. How you people can sit back and call this normal is, is I, it's unfathomable. Please, please go outside and look up. Please. The planet can't take much more of this. Things are gonna start to die. Plants, animals, your kids, you. This is insane. How can you not see this happening? How can you still deny this? How do you not believe this? I can't make this shit up. This is happening. It's happening right now. Wilmington, North Carolina, and above you too. It's happening. It's really happening. Normal, huh? This is normal? Please, please wake up. I'm just speechless. Where do I live? What what planet is this? Look. That's east. The sun goes this way. See the way they're spraying? See the way they started? Started way over there. They're following the sun. They're blocking the sun. What happens when the sun is gone? What needs sun to live? It's just really simple math. Just ask yourself, where does all this lead to? What happens? What happens when the sun is blocked out? What depends on the sun? What can't live without the sun? Even if it's not totally gone, just gone a little bit. What happens? Please, just think about it. Never mind what's in this stuff, the nanoparticles and stuff. Never mind what makes this shit work. I'll get to that in one second. Seems uh, this guy had a little change of direction plan. <laughs> There's a reason that they're doing this. There's a reason that they're doing this. It's up to you to find it out. I'm not even gonna put it out there anymore. If you people don't care enough, Boy, you can lead a horse to water, but sure as hell can't make them think. There's a reason. There's a reason for these. And it's not for, it's not so you could load kitty pictures. You better wake up. Chemtrails and those towers go hand in hand. There's a reason these are everywhere everywhere you don't see one go look by a school that should be clue number one go look by a school and please go look up what are you going to do about it i don't know but we need to do something because this can't the planet can't go like this It's 
just normal, right? It's all just normal. Really? Really? Wow. Yeah, just insane. And also recently, Truth Stream Media just came out with a great report on chemtrails talking about the NASA expert who openly is admitting the geoengineering program. And, uh, you know, all this is out in the open and people still want to deny. You have people in cognitive dissonance on this and you have people who are just are completely blind to it because, of course, they're just glued to their cell phones. They are not at all aware of what's going on in the sky they're not aware of anything <laughs> it doesn't involve their cell phone so true stream media if you're not subscribed subscribe to true stream media because they do great reports on chemtrails and gmos um, if you're interested in those topics they do some of the best reports on that and if you see here this is what he's talking about the chemtrail uh, nasa expert so right there his first example of using existing technology to put these aerosols into the sky is using jet aircraft so is it ridiculous to talk about chemtrails in the sky being part of geoengineering? Absolutely not. It's being discussed in a very serious format here in NASA at the Jet Propulsion Lab about how to mitigate climate change, what to do about it, what's being discussed. And he goes on to talk about all the negative consequences that they know can happen from this. There are a lot of Absolutely. I'll leave a link for you guys in the description. Check out this whole video. And last but not least, I wanted to point out to you guys how big this whole chemtrail thing is uh it's it is so important to um these uh crazy bastards plans that you know they go through the trouble of sub uh, subconsciously and subliminally c conditioning you in our media in movies even in disney movies i've seen you know and in commercials everywhere uh they've seen i've seen in the background they condition you to be used to chemtrails check this out on our news reports you'll see in the background uh, of the uh, in the back of the news anchors you'll see chemtrails right here checkered skies in the back just absolute madness man i mean look at this right in the background of an, of your you know local evening news report that is just insane and uh just goes to show you that how important this is uh, well, how big this agenda is just don't don't be a chemtrail denier please i mean we already have to deal with sandy hook the hoax deniers boston hoax deniers boston smoke bomb firecracker deniers uh 9 11 deniers i mean <laughs> come on just at least wake up to chemtrails this is your wake up call pal <laughs>